Hello guys, this is Lechirpty Gaming here, and today I'm playing a new game. I'm playing a game called Prison Architect, and I plan on doing a little mini series on this because it's a long game. It's a strategy game, obviously. It takes a while, and you build a prison, and you have to run it, and you have to manage it. Uh, things can go wrong. Prisoners can escape. Um, you can go bankrupt. A lot of nasty things, and apparently. In recent patches, if you perform bad, you get sentenced to your own prison. Uh, I know I'm doing this a bit quickly, I know. So yeah, I'm just, I'm just giving you guys the basic explanation. So you build a prison, and it has to be a good prison, and the goal of the game is just, you know, make a nice prison, I guess. Earn money. Uh, it's a lot of fun on the way, so I thought I'm going to record it, because there's also some funny things that happen. That you can see some funny looking people, so this is bound to end well. Anyway, so we're gonna create a prison. So I'm just gonna open up the menu. I'm gonna create a prison. Let's see. Uh, let's do a male prison. Uh, let's see. We got a list of characters we can choose. I'm just reading these real quickly. I like the warden. You know, he seems the most balanced individual on the planet. That seems like me. I'm not really too much of a a one-sided sort of thing myself. I like a well-balanced -bal leader of a prison. Anyways, so let's just look over here. Um, so this is kind of like how you can set the difficulty. So I want a medium-sized prison, and I can kind of see the difficulty here. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to make this really hard for myself. I'm not the best at this game, but I think it'll be entertaining if I just really try. I'm up for a challenge. So I'm going to turn on gangs. I'm going to turn on events. And I should do it, actually. That should probably mess me over. And I'll... I'll I'll do weather and temperature as well, why not? So let's play the game. Alright, is that it? Alright, so it started up. Ah, uh, yes, I see. So my workers, you can see them on the road. They're coming in. In the old su supply truck. So in this game, before we start building a prison, you don't want to like buy stuff right away. You have a set amount of money. So this is my money up here, guys. This is the money I make per day. I want to plan this prison out. So, alright. Deliveries, garbage. I think I'm going to go for a nice walkway into my prison. So, you, you can never go wrong. I'm going to start a walkway. And let's see what we need. So, we can look at the rooms. You can build a whole bunch of rooms in this. So, you got cells, holding cells, solitary, dormitory, canteen, kitchen. you got all this stuff you need to make a decent prison. So, um, so, yeah. so for a prison, right, when our prisoners come in, you know, they get loaded off the trucks, they come down our pathway, they have to go somewhere. Um, I'm pretty sure the first place your prisoners want to go is to a a reception. Yeah, it says right here where your prisoners are first taken when they arrive. So we want to build a reception. So that's the first thing we want to do. I guess this is where the prisoners come. They check into the prison. You know, they get their prison jumpers. <laughs> um, I think it sounds pretty good. So I think I'll do that. So we're going to design a reception. So for a reception, we're going to need... It has to be indoors, obviously. It needs an office desk, a table, and a chair. So let's try this. So I'm going to whip out the old planning, and they're going to walk in. So one, two, three. I think right about uh, here, I think. We'll, we'll start, we'll start the, the planning of the room. So let's see. Three that way, three this way. So we'll, we'll make it a nice size, make it a bit bigger. Um, looks like a pretty big reception, if, you, if I'd say so myself. About ten. Sure. We'll have a nice long sort of reception. So the prisoners are going to come in, get loaded off the trucks, they're going to be brought into here, and this is where they're going to sign in, and they're going to be given their jumper. So we'll make a doorway here. I don't think we need a path for the inside. So, okay, so the prisoners are going to come in. I'm going to see what else we need. So we need an office desk, a table, and a chair. Alright, so we'll go into objects. So we need an office desk. Oh, actually, I should probably plan this out instead of uh, an office desk, so, yeah, we can get an office desk. Oh, I'll, I'll, I'll do this after, actually. Let's just build the foundation, because I think this is the size we want it to be. And let's make a nice brick um, foundation. So this is going to be our prison. So it's going to build. I'm just going to speed up time so these guys can build it faster. And obviously it needs an entrance, so we need to build the door. So I'm just going to go into objects here. I'm just going to select the jail door. And... One here, one here. So they're going to go in here. They're going to come in through this door here. They're going to go through this door. They're going to get signed into the prison. And they're going to go through this door. And they're going to get into the prison. This prison's looking great. They're installing the lights. 
Alright, it's looking good. So, let's just pause this. Um, so I think what we need, yeah, we need the office desk. So I think up here in the corner would be a nice place for an office desk. So we're just going to go to objects, office desk, uh, I think right up here is a nice place. We need a chair as well for the desk, obviously. Uh, chair. So I guess this is where, like, they get kind of signed in over here. So I think that's pretty cool. Uh, and I need a table. Alright, so they're gonna get, they're gonna come in, they're gonna get signed in, uh, a table, I don't know what the table's for, as I said, I haven't played this game much, so they're gonna get this table, let's just put the table here, I guess, up against here, so they get signed in, I don't know, there's a table here, and then we want, we want to kind of, like, keep these guys around, so I guess over here we want, like, cause, like, you know, this is where everyone who comes in the prison, I guess, is technically gonna come through here, so we'll make it nice, we'll put some, like, nice seating, for people who like, you know, like the shareholders and stuff who own the prison. We'll put like seats here so we can hold the prisoners. Um, you know, kind of like something nice before they have to go to the prison. We'll put them in here. So that's good. I think this is good. And then we have to set this room. So I'm going to make it the reception. So I'm just going to... There we go. And... It should be looking good. Oh, yeah, they're just installing this stuff. And then while they're doing that... Let's start working on the bit where they're going to go into the prison. So I think they should go into, like, I guess sort of an airlock, I would say. Because prisons are all about airlocks, because you don't want someone bursting on a door and being home free. You want them to burst down several doors and then get stuck on the eight doors. That's just how prisons work. <laughs> this is from my experience in the game, at least. So we're going to create, like, an airlock over here. And then, as you can see, we need electricity and utility. So I think... Uh, over this airlock, I'm going to build like a hallway, right? Stay with me here. I'm going to build a hallway. And I'm going to build a room. I guess uh, I guess it should be a fairly mm, fairly large. No, I don't like that. I'm going to make that smaller. I guess a decent sized room. And then this is where we're going to have our prison utilities. So in here, uh, we're going to have our hallway. And it's going to lead up into here. Then into here, we're going to have like our boiler and our water pump and stuff like that so I think that's looking good so we want to get our utility so let's just do this so alright let's what do we need we need the foundation we're gonna use a brick foundation and I'm just gonna stick it in here uh, come up here and we'll just build the foundation and so on so I'll let these guys get at it while they're building that I'm gonna stick in a door here and stick in a door here as well. And I guess because we want them to go out, right? Oh, they have to remove these trees. We're going to stick a door in over here because this is where, like, this airlock's going to lead into the prison. So this is kind of like a separate area. This is where the, um, the construction workers or the people who work on the oh, stuff come in. Let's get rid of some of this stuff. Uh, material. So we'll have the brick wall. So we have a brick wall here, here. Oh, no. Actually, I don't want that. Oh, actually, I, I, we can push this wall back. This wall doesn't have to be here. And actually, speaking about planning, I'm going to have to dismantle this door. But it won't cost me too much. At least we have a spare. Actually, I'm going to dismantle this door here. So I've just realized I want a staff door. So there's different doors you can get. You can get, like, a large door, a staff door. A staff door is a door only, like, your staff members can go through. And I think that's fine because we only want, like, we want our staff members to be able to enter and do repairs and, like, the utilities and stuff. So I think we have, like, a staff door. It allows, like, because these doors, they require, like, a guard to come and open it for them. And it's a bit, like, cumbersome for, like, an officer to have to come and unlock it for, like, these workers to work on the stuff. So I'm just going to maybe avoid that. Is that door here? Yeah, I think it is. I can't place anything there. That door looks a bit weird. It seems to be in the wall. Uh, <laughs> anyways, so we got this. And we'll go into our utilities as well as we can see and I'm just gonna stick this generator right here and we need the water pump station as well and we'll just stick it stick this right here actually no wait wait cancel that uh, we'll push this back here and then we're gonna need a water boiler because we're gonna need hot water let's get like two water boilers in yeah We'll chuck in two water boilers, and we got our power, so let's hook up this power 
with the station hopefully that's a decent enough ca connection and these need power as well so I guess I'm bring this along here and over here sort of thing yeah that works and then I guess we can kinda take some cable and bring it into here so we can get the lights to work as well so we'll bring this into here so now we got this going and we'll use the water after so we have our utilities I don't know what oh and I guess we also want to put in a capacitor as well so I'll stick some capacitors in there so we'll stick in some capacitors and it's gonna make this nice we'll stick in why aren't these powered all these lights um let's see utilities is it working is this even on I have no idea Ah. Huh. I guess it's maybe I'm missing something I probably need mm, no it's probably fine that's probably fine I mean I don't know why the lights aren't going on um I've already, I've already run into a problem what's going on here maybe it's probably probably these maybe I shouldn't have all these connected back here maybe that's causing an issue I'll have these guys come and uh, remove this and I'm gonna go in here. This is our prisoner intake. So I guess I'm gonna set it to fill capacity because we don't want any prisoners. We haven't built any cells or anything yet. We'll close that down. I don't know what's going on here. A bit fishy. A bit fishy. Um, I don't know what this means here. This whole. Huh. Let's see. Or maybe it's not even hooked up yet. No, it is hooked up. Or am I hooked this up on the wrong side? Perhaps I don't know what this is like. This red icon here, and I don't know what that means. If I what if I stick that in there? Well, no. Okay, something's obviously not working, and we also have double walls here. I've also just noticed that. Uh, so I'm gonna demolish these walls. Get rid of them. We don't want them because we we just push this wall back. Um. Oh. Do I Oh, would you look at that? That makes sense. I had to turn it on. Okay. That, that 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 made some actual sense there. I didn't turn it on. Probably should have thought of that first. Uh, anyways. In the utilities, alright. So, we want to get some water coming from, like, these... From the pump into the boiler. So, I think I'm going to do that. So, I'm just going to get, like, these water pipes. And they're going to be pumping wa cold water into the boilers and it's gonna get heat up and it's gonna come out it's gonna be great so yeah ah, this is coming along quite nicely and about this pathway too going into the prison um... Hmm. I think we can go for a nice stone actually so I'm just gonna go into materials here and I'm gonna grab some stone so I think I like the look of the stone I think it's gonna look really nice so they come in you come down a nice stone pathway into the prison. It's gonna be good. Oh, look at that! That looks amazing already. This is coming along so well. Oh, and all these. Oh, oh, I know why. All this stuff is being backed up, and that's because we're ordering. We have all this extra stuff. We have nowhere to put it. So I think we need to make a storage room. So just because we don't want all these materials lying around in the prison, like we don't want logs and nails, and the prisoners come in and then they can like beat somebody up with it. No, no, I'm not all about that. I'm all about law and discipline. I'm not all about this smashing other dudes' face in with like two by fours and stuff. All right, so what do I need? Storage, storage. Can I see this? Uh, there it is. I'm just gonna come up. I'll I'll stick the storage room like right next to the deliveries. That looks good. So I guess now the workers should move this stuff to the storage. I believe. Let's see if they start doing it. Yeah, yeah. So look. Oh, there we go. Look at this, they're already moving it already. Perfect. Alright, so we got the reception. We got the utilities. And now, I think... Are these... Are these facing the wrong way? These sofas? Let's see. Oh, crap. I think they are. Are they? Oh, no, they're not. Oh, no, they're facing the right way. This is how they look. They just look really weird. Alright, so it's pretty cold. They've added a new feature to this game right, uh, recently. Like, I haven't played this in a while, and I've come back to it. And they have, like, a temperature feature now. So you kind of have to, like, heat your prison. 
So thank God we put these water boilers in, because I just realized we want to keep this place heated. So I'm going to stick some rads in my, like, the chairs here, I think. And we might also want one here and one here, just to keep the place warm and we'll install that. And then these have to be hooked up with the new hot water feature as well. So I'm going to jump into utilities and, okay, so I think in here, right, this is where they kind of came in. Uh... And we need to connect the hot water to one of the boilers, so we'll do this. And then I'm going to speed this up and the worker should come. We should install the boilers. Here they go. Install the boilers. Yep, they need hot water, but don't worry. They'll be hooked up to the boilers in any moment. It's looking good. And while they're doing that, we can start planning the prison as well. Um. Oh, this isn't hooked up. Is it? Oh, I missed that. Oh, what a waste. I'll just... Uh, get rid of all this. Put it on this side. There we go. Stick that in there. Perfect. Okay, so now we're getting heat into the prison. So it should be warm, I guess, when it comes in. No one has to freeze, you know, their nuts off or anything. Nothing nothing too gruesome. Because uh, I'm not about a gruesome, gory prison, you know. I'm going to run this place, you know, the right way. The way a prison should be ran. Anyway, so... So we got this. Let's jump into planning. So they, alright, let's see, so they go through this airlock. This is gonna be like, maybe like a corridor, so like people can go to like offices and maybe other utilities and stuff, and then we'll have like a prisoner corridor. So, when they come out, I want them to come into sort of like another hallway, right? And then we'll have this hallway sort of like lead down, I, I, I guess? We'll have it like, alright, we'll have it like lead down into here. Okay, I already like the look of this. And it leads into here. And I think, okay, so we'll just build a hallway that goes this way then. Right? Something like this. Uh, yeah, so we'll have something like this, and it'll be like this wide hallway. And then I think we should start working on the cell block. So we'll start working on the jail cell. So I think, uh, what kind of jail cell? I'm, I'm going to go... But when, because what I know from playing this game, like, later on, in logistics, you can sort of research, like, types of, like, prison cells. There's different, like, levels of prison cells and what prisoners deserve and stuff. I, I generally give them a bigger cell. I do this just to keep the prisoners happy, because I don't want them being angry and starting riots and stuff. So I kind of have, like, an in-the-middle sort of, like, you know, how they, how they like their cells. So normally people, you see them do, like, the 2 by three cells. I like to do the three by three. I like to give them a little bit more room. Uh, cause they're people, you know, they're not like animals. We're not gonna cage them up. Uh, so I'm just gonna, gonna give them like a decent sized cell. Obviously I'm not gonna give them like freaking like radios or any, well, we'll see. I, I mean, it's better, honestly, if I can put TVs in these cells and it distract, like I'd rather have a prisoner watching TV than stabbing a guard. Like, if he's bored, I don't want him to go stab one of my guards, no. Or shank another prisoner, or do stuff in the showers, or God knows what these prisoners do when they get rowdy. I want him to watch TV instead of cause any more public distress for the reason why he's in here. So I guess we can start the cell block. As you see, I've kind of started like my line of cells, and I want to start some more cells over here. So I guess it looks like we're getting like about nine cells in here. Alright, and this is already this is already looking good. And they got like little entrances. Okay, this is looking good. So we can get like nine prisoners in right away. So this is looking really nice. All right, so let's go to the foundations. Uh, we're still using brick, brick. So we'll get a nice brick foundation in here, and we'll hook this up. This is looking beautiful already. All right, let's just let's let our workers uh, jump into this. So they're building that. Uh, lights are nice. They gotta cut down these trees. I'm trying to think if there's anything else we need. Uh, so we have the cells. I guess because we want to get like our prisoners in. Because as you can see, like I'm running low on money up here, right? We want to have like an influx of prisoners. Because we get paid for the prisoners we have. So I guess we'd want prisoners. And oh wait, before before we start bringing in the prisoners, we want to give them somewhere to eat, right? Because they have to eat. So up here, I want them to work on the canteen in the kitchen so this hallway we'll have this hallway right and actually no we'll lead it we'll lead it up here 
Alright, that's looking good. Yeah, yeah. And it'll, it'll lead up here, and actually we can demolish these walls here, I guess. Uh, demolish walls. Because this is going to be like a continuing hallway. So we'll just like demolish these walls, we'll put like a nice foundation in there, and then like... I guess somewhere like... Hmm. I guess we're going to have like our canteen or our kitchen be like this size. And it's where the prisoners are going to come in to eat and stuff. So they're going to come into here. They're going to come into this room. And let's see. Let's put a... We'll put like a double door here, I guess. Actually, no. We'll just put the entrance down here because it'll make sense. Uh, Just to keep it down here. So we'll demolish this wall, I guess. So I'm going to jump into here. Demolish wall. So we'll demolish this. And this is where our canteen kitchen is going to be. So we're going to have our table. So we're, they're going to come in here. We're going to pack these guys in nice and nice and orderly. And we're going to have our, our tables, I guess. Our, I think the tables are like three wide. Oh, no. And they're going to be nice. So this is where we're gonna, our prisoners are going to sit. So the tables and the benches are going to be like this size, I think. We're going to come in. They're gonna, let me just check. So objects. Uh, let's see, tables. Yeah, yeah, that's about the size of a table. So they're going to come in here, and this is where they're going to sit, right? Meanwhile, back here, um, so they're going to come in, and there's going to be like a walkway in here, and then through here, we're going to have like another wall, and then for a canteen, I know we need like a serving table. So like down here they can like come in here, they can pick up their food and then go to like these tables. So I'm gonna put one, two, three, four. I'm gonna put like a serving table down here. And then up here is where the staff can get into the kitchen. So there's gonna be like a doorway and then we can have like our uh kitchen stuff so we can have like our cooker and our fridge and stuff in here. It's gonna be great, it's gonna be great. So actually while we're doing that, we might as well jump in the foundations. I'll just put on place so these guys and finish up this. Uh we're using a nice brick foundation. I don't generally use the brick foundation. I should actually. It's a. Re it's really nice. Well, I didn't do that right. Uh. Oh, it doesn't want to do it. I guess we have to finish this foundation before we can. And actually, I want to put a door. Obviously, we need oh some sort of door going into the cafeteria. Um. Good. Oh, it's progress. Look at this. This is really ther therapeutic. And all this stuff's going into here. Alright, so that's built. And I can kind of shove the hallway into here, right? Good. That's looking good already. And we got the lights. And while they're building this, we have to hook up electricity and water to the here, obviously. I'm going to put in the wall we need here. And then I'm going to go in the objects. And we need the stuff we need for a canteen. So f for those who don't know, for a canteen, I'm pretty sure... You need tables, benches, chairs, and you definitely need a serving table. So I'm going to type in serving table, and here we go. And we're going to stick our serving table in here. So the prisoner that come, they're going to pick up their food, and they're going to sit on the chairs. So we got our serving table objects. We also want a table. Oh, gosh. We want a table as well. And we stick in tables here. Well, these tables are pricey. They're like $100 each. And we also want a bench. So the... So the prisoners can come and they can uh, sit at these tables. So we'll put benches here. Oh god, I messed up on that bench. And we'll just stick them in like that. And they're going to come and they're going to build up. And that's looking good. And then for the kitchen, we also want a staff door. To prevent guys. Or Yeah, we only want the, the cooks coming in to cook the food. So that's great. And I think we, for the kitchen as well, we're going to need a fridge. I know that for sure. We definitely need a fridge because we're we going to store the food. So we'll tuck in a fridge. We'll get a sink as well. So we can clean the dishes. We'll chuck in a sink or like here or something. And we're going to get ourselves a cooker. And we'll just chuck it in up here. Give it, we'll, we'll space them out nicely. You know. And I think that's looking good. So, we've got that. We've got the canteen. Um, oh. So, we've got all this. And we just about got the cells. So, I'm just going to fill in these cells. 
because we forgot to do this. I'm going to just manually. And these guys are just going to come in, they're going to build them all. There we go. And these are going to be our cells. So, alright. Uh, oh, and they haven't installed walls here properly. So we've got this. This needs water, obviously. Uh, these all need doors down here as well. So I'm going to chuck, oh, doors on, because these are cells, right? We don't want prisoners wandering around, so we have to put doors down here. And actually, I might move this cell later. Actually, because I want this, actually, I want this whole way to come down, so actually, I'm going to change this. This is not going to be a, a, uh, I'll watch my color, a cell, so I'm just going to remove this. Because I really, I want this whole way to come right down, and we can have, like, multiple, like, ho um, hallways, like, branching out. I think that's going to work. I, I like that. And we're going to have, like, multiple, like, cell blocks. Yeah, that's going to work well. So let's just get rid of this. And this, we'll continue this hallway, like, another time. Uh, so yeah, this is the kitchen. It's looking good. Anyways, guys, uh, this is the first video. Um, hopefully you guys, uh, so we've just kind of laid out the, um, the bare bones of the prison, I guess, the, the skeleton. Uh, we're going to elaborate on this. Maybe next time we'll get the prisoners in. This is just the plan of me discussing it with you. So hopefully this turns out well. Uh, I'll be back for another episode. Anyways. If you like, please leave a like, comment below, and this is the Church of Gaming, signing off.